welcome back to Fox and Robin Recording. Today we have um, some new news. We have customized our desk. We took a Gator Frameworks desk and took the, what would normally be here, there'd be a rack here that had gear. We took that and we cut it in half and we put it on each end of our desk here um, and kind of screwed it so it won't move. It, it's gonna stay pretty stable. Um, we did that and actually so far we love it. So in the comments, let, you, let us know what you think of those. Um, what we've done with them, just, you know, shoot us a comment or message, whatever. And, uh, you know, we'll let you know what we think about what you think. Anyways, uh, that's kind of what's new, um, in that realm. Uh, we're still in the new space and we're still figuring some things out, but, um, you can see we got a new amp behind us. Not that one, but it's somewhere over here, somewhere behind me. It's the, basically it's a 59 Fender Bassman by jo uh, owned by Josh Scott of JHS Pedals. Um, so it's all hand wired, it, it sounds phenomenal. Um, we'll do a video on that later. Um, but we also want to say thank you and uh, the appreciation we have for those who have liked and subscribed to our channel. Uh, we are super grateful um, and you know, keep doing it, keep watching our stuff. Uh, we also want to tell those who haven't liked and subscribed, go ahead and do it. Go hit that bell, hit the notifications, do everything that you need to do to like and subscribe to our channel and uh, watch our content. If you find information, great. If you like it, that's great too. If not, you know, let us know what we can do better. Anyways, uh, today's video is not about that. Today's video is about what's in this black box. Um, this is um, a Loughton Audio set that I got. This is the LA-20. There's a pair of them in here. Um, they are small diaphragm condensers. Um, hopefully, uh, they work well for our setup down here. If not, we'll find we'll find a use for them. Um, but this is kind of an unboxing of that. So um, it comes in. It obviously came in a brown box that was uh, shipped to us. Um, we've already taken it. We wanted to make sure what was in here was kosher. So, anyways, um, we bought these, I believe, from Loughton off their B stock. So these are B stock from Loughton. Um, not paid. It's not a paid video from them. Um, if they want to send us some more stuff, have us do paid stuff, we'd love it. Um, but anyways, it's a cool box. It's all black. That tells you they're transformerless. Um, they're sonically flexible. Kind of gives you a whole rundown on the mics themselves, what they kind of look like. Um, the, the model number on them, they're the LA-120s. Um, it says designed in Silicon Valley by Loughton. That's what it says on the boxer. So the box is cool. It's got this nice magnetic flap here. And if you can kind of hear that. It's got a magnetic flap here that keeps the box closed and you open it up and in there it says welcome to the family so we got that you got a nice little basically you got a whole bunch of documentation in here on the mics themselves and you know congrats it actually says congrats on your new microphones um so that's kind of that in a nutshell uh and we does have this nice little top box with a foam little backing to it that will keep your mics and then on the inside it looks like this it's got your mics and a nice little foam um you've got your two pencil condensers your clips your foam and some extra capsules now these can be either cardioid or they can be a uh they can be omni you, you get both capsules basically they just unscrew and i'll show you here in a minute they unscrew you unscrew the old one screw the new one and now uh, they're a different microphone almost um or different polar pattern not microphone um, they did come wrapped in plastic and i unwrapped them for this video so this is what they look like. Um, I'm gonna set one down here. So we've got the Loughton. You've got a high pass switch, which is 50 and 50 hertz and 150, and then you got a low pass, which is 10 kilohertz and 15 kilohertz, which I find kind of interesting. That has it has a low pass on it. Um, we're gonna play with that, these settings and see what that could be used for. You know, it's kind of like having some EQ settings on your microphone. Um, it's got a nice badge that's, that's printed on, well, it's got etching in it, actually. It's not even printed. It's actually etching. Um, and then the badge is kind of an etched in thing as well. Um, your standard XLR, they are condensers, obviously. So you need four, uh, 48 volts. Um, so what unscrews from here, and I'm kind of going through this quickly, but what unscrews is this capsule here. This is the cardioid capsule. And if you just twist, it just, it just unscrews. You just hit Kind of like unscrew and it just unscrews like that and then you take the other capsule like this it's still wrapped up take this omni capsule and there you go 
So you could do like, you could potentially do like a bloom line type thing with these where you've got your Omni and a cardioid. That's sort of bloom line. Bloom line would be with a figure eight, which would, these would be great to do with a figure eight. You know, I could take one of my 414s or my, not 414s, so WA14s, stick it together and do like a bloom line team thing with them. Um, we're gonna try them on acoustic guitar. We're gonna try them on hi-hat. Um, I've heard great things about them on drums and hi-hats um, and acoustic guitars as well, but we might try them on maybe a guitar amp or maybe um, snare drum or room mic. Um, we have lots of options with these guys. So basically there's two of them, the L120, LA120s, come as a pair you can buy them as a pair here um i'm not gonna tell you how much i paid for them because honestly i can't remember um it may have been a little more actually it was less because they're be stock so a little more than used less than brand new is kind of what you're looking at um i buy a lot of things be stock so i can't always remember what i spent on them um but that is essentially the 120s um in a box here and I just keep them in the box because they look, it looks nice. You've got a nice little lid here you can put back on and put your documentation back in so you don't lose that. And you close it up and put it on the shelf. And since it says LA120 on each side of the box, you can just put it on your shelf or wherever you keep your microphones. I got a shelf over here where I keep my mics. Um, you can just keep them there. And, uh, you know, when you need them, you just pull them out, set them up, and do whatever you need with them. So, that's kind of the 120 boxing slash overview. Um, we might do some videos where we're like, okay, this is what it would sound if we were to use these as just a pair of overheads, you know. Um, we're working on a few things. Um, you may have noticed I got Logic running in the back here. We have kind of switched back to Logic for some, for actually all of our production for some various reasons. And we'll do a video on that here soon. So look on a video for why we've switched back to Luna or from Luna to Logic. Um, you'll see a video on that here soon. Um, but in the long run, that's these mics. Um, I hear great things about them. We'll do a shootout of how they sound with cheaper mics, like the much lower range. These are like 400, like that 400 to 500 range. And we'll test them with like maybe some cheaper ones that are like, oh, these are the hundred dollar range, you know, $200 range. Um, we might do a video on that here soon. Um, or at least by the end of the year. I don't know if we'll get to it this month, but maybe by the end of the year, we'll get to it um anyways that's today's video uh we're super excited for all those who have liked and subscribed and hit the bell for their uh for our content and you know what if you haven't yet go do so and you know what we'll see you next time go make some music